more gang welcome back so today's tutorial i wanted to come to you guys and show you this new and faster way to apply your lace front wig versus using the got to be gel or the got to be free spray so if you guys are interested to see exactly what product i will be using to apply my lace front wig which is so much easier then definitely keep watching this video So the wig unit that I will be installing today is from Allie Grace. I have their Bob unit. Um, it's a lace front wig. Uh, the hair type is Brazilian. I believe the length is 12 inches. Inside the unit, it does come with four combs as well as adjustable straps. So I did want to show you guys up close how the hairline comes. Uh, they state that the hairline is pre-plucked, but I definitely will have to go in and pluck some more on this hairline. And I did realize that I can't pluck too much because this is not a ordinary lace front wig. Uh, you only get a little bit of lace uh, for the hairline, as you guys can see. In the inside of the unit, um, you really are only able to wear this unit as a middle part only. So I have already cut the excess lace off of the unit and now I'm just basically going in and installing it onto my head. I will be using um, my little techniques to lay the part down um, and the rest of the unit a little bit flatter. Um, and then I will be going in and showing you guys this new product that I came across to lay down uh, your lace front wigs. Okay, so I came across this product when I was at my local beauty supply store. It is the Fantasia Super Hole Spritz Hairspray. I know it's similar to the Pump It Up spray, but it's not as harsh and it doesn't leave like a white residue. And I really wanted to try this out because I've been using like the Got To Be Gel, the Got To Be Free spray, but you guys know that you have to be really, really careful when it comes to applying Got To Be because it does leave like a white residue residue and then it also can clump up and just cause all type of mess when it comes to your hairline so I came across this product and I used it before when applying my lace front wig and I decided to go ahead and do a tutorial to show you guys how easy it is to apply this to your hairline and get your lace front wig to lay flat and not move so pretty much all I do is just spray um, section by section and I use my blow dryer to uh, dry the uh, hairspray and I just apply my lace front wig. This literally took me about five, five to seven minutes to lay down my lace front wig using this product. So using the Fantasia Spritz hairspray, you're basically doing the normal steps you would do if you was to apply Got To Be Gel or uh, apply Got To Be Free Spray. But the good thing about this spray is the fact that it doesn't leave like that horrible white residue that the Got To Be Gel does. Now the only thing about this spray is the fact that when you do apply it, it does run down a little bit. So you gotta, you have to make sure that you kind of catch it so it's not running everywhere because it is a water-based or it's not like thick. So that's the only issue that I did have. Another thing is when I did get it on my skin, um, it didn't leave like a really noticeable um area it didn't show so and if it did show just a little bit all i did was take like a washcloth and um just wipe it off and it came right off so yeah you guys i'm going to go ahead and continue to um lay down my lace front wig but i did want to let you guys know a little bit about this wig unit that i got from ally grace now um there was no smell or odor the texture of this hair is like a straight texture but it is a very silky straight texture 
Um, it does apply well to heat. I didn't have any issues with um, installing the wig unit. The only thing that I do not like about this unit is the fact that it does not come with a lot of parting space. I definitely would recommend Ally Grace kind of changing the way that they made their lace on their lace front wig. I do not like the fact that you really only get about one inch to two inch of um, space around the hairline and then they give you that definite part the only part that you are able to get is the middle part you're not able to part it on the side or anything else so i definitely would recommend that they would change that i love the way that they um cut this unit it flows very nicely um it looks sort of like a asymmetrical bob it's like short in the back and then it gets longer when it comes to the sides i love how it flows and everything so if you guys are interested in this unit i would definitely leave all the information down below in the description section but pretty much you guys this is a tutorial i wanted to come to you really fast and show you this really nice new bob that i got as well as how i apply the lace front uh wig onto my head so i just want to say thank you so much for watching you guys this is my last tutorial for 2018 um if you haven't subscribed to my channel definitely subscribe so you can stay up to date on all my videos and then make sure you guys um check to make sure that your notification is turned all the way on so you can get notified every time i upload and once again, you guys, as always, like, comment, and share. And I will see you guys in 2019.